You almost hit John with your car. Can you not hit me with your car? I'm so time? sorry. I'll work on it. Halloween. <laughs> if you're a zom if you're a zombie, I'd eat you. Dude, I would. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'd eat you. So, Christmas. It's a great time. That's of year. right, you didn't have anything to say. Halloween, however. Great time of year. Great time of year. To me, you got a, any Halloween pickup lines I could use? Um, are you a spirit? Because you're my kind of ghoul. I am not a spirit, actually. What are you guys going as? Um, the thumb characters from Spy Kids. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going as for Halloween this year? You know what? I was thinking about dressing up as Joe Biden. It's Mr. T. <laughs> and I don't know if anyone will know who that is. Um, I just know I'm going to dress up as a red crayon. Miles, my next uh, question. What are you going as for Halloween, bro? Thomas the Tank Engine. I I'm going as... You got a favorite movie? Favorite movie? Favorite Halloween movie? Home Alone. Fair movie, fair movie. Favorite movie? Halloween. 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 The horror movie. Oh, the movie Halloween. You know, I was never into scary movies too much, although I, I did like the Blair Witch. Uh, what's it called? The Blair Witch. <laughs> We're trying to have an interview here, buddy. And they go in there at night and it's filmed with a video camera. Sudden they get attacked and it's moving around and that. So you don't know what happens. I mean, some of these scary movies are fakey. Like, you know, when you turn on the faucet and blood's running out, maybe it's time to leave the house, right? No, let's stay. Maybe there's a plumbing issue. I mean, come on, that's fakey. Well, it looks like we have a fan mail. Uh, I've always liked Halloween since I was a kid. You know, big into the trick or treating. Candy corn, all that stuff, corn mazes. I don't know. I'm just big, big Halloween guy. Anyway. Would you like to add on that? Man, I love Halloween. And back here is the office of the Dr. Fallon. Dr. Fallon? Yeah, hold on a minute. Fix that room. I'll be right there. I'll call you back. Yes! How are we doing? You want an interview? Well, I guess we could do that. Sit on down. Dr. Fallon, do you believe in ghosts? Well, I might just a little bit. I do have one story. Let's hear it. So when I was down in South Carolina, there's this place right down the river called Savannah, Georgia. And legend has it that a lot of pirates sort of disappeared through the floor, through a trap door. And when you went into this restaurant and you go upstairs, if you're real quiet, you can sit there and hear things creeping in the back hall. So that's the closest I've been to actually hearing and seeing a ghost. What is the weirdest Halloween costume you wore when you were younger? All right, you ready for this one? I'm going to get in a little trouble here, religion-wise. So when other young folks back in my time were dressing as Batman and Superman and all the heroes, guess whose aunt made him a St. Francis costume? And what are you going to go as for Halloween? Well, you know, I was thinking about getting out of my standard everyday attire and maybe doing something different. Like, let's see, which should I pick? Oh, I think I'll go as an elephant this year. Bye, Dr. Fallon. What's that? 